My favorite Auburn memory was the national championship game. I was one of the lucky students that got a student ticket to go to Scottsdale, Arizona. So I was there to give Cam Newton a high five, which I'll never wash my right hand ever again. And it's something that if I'm alive 50 years from now, I can't wait to tell my kids and my grandkids about. It would have to be Sullivan and Beasley. And I can remember uh, being in the drugstore and making lemonades for Sullivan and Beasley when they'd come in here after football practice. The other great Auburn tradition that is no more is the Burn the Bulldog pep rally. Before the Georgia game, there would be a massive bonfire, a massive pep rally. And it was really special to hold your girl's hand, look at that fire blazing, looking at stars in the sky. You hoped to beat Georgia in the next day, but you still had a good time at the bonfire, even if you didn't. Uh, a lot of memories in a small town that you cherish for a lifetime, and and the people that you've gotten to know and meet and that are so important to the growth of a community. The biggest legend in my mind is my mother. Uh, she passed this past year. She was Miss Auburn in 1949. And my mother meant everything. It was a very gracious lady and passed a lot of things on to family and friends and to a lot of people in the city of Auburn. Uh, by far, it is the Tiger Walk. Uh, when I was at Auburn, we used to gather up at Sewell Hall because we lived in Sewell Hall. And, and as the players came down together in the parking lot, uh, the fans would start cheering, uh, the band would start playing, and you would start hearing War Eagle fly down the field. And, and let me tell you, it got you motivated to play. Tailgating, that is just a great Auburn tradition. And just the camaraderie of the Auburn people and that spirit that goes on on this campus on game day. And also now to see it in my three daughters and my wife and their friends, they come and tailgate every Saturday. It's just a real fun time, a real wholesome time. Another tradition that I love, and it's kind of close to my heart, is every year, sometime during the football season, um, an award is given out to the most valuable Auburn male athlete. And the award is called the Cliff Hare Award. It was named in honor of my grandfather. The inscription on the award says that athletics make men strong, study makes men wise, and character makes men great. Auburn gets in your heart and it changes it. If you become an Auburn man or an Auburn woman and that Auburn spirit is inside of you, you'll never be the same, ever.